Panther Nation, what's cracking? Draft family, what's good? Hey, man, listen, we got another one coming up. Uh, his name is Jalen Twyman. Don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. I apologize in advance. But listen, this kid is going to be, uh, could be a sneaky pick. Sneaky pick. Doing a little research on the kid. Uh, and I like what I see. I do like what I see. This kid is out of pit, a defensive tackle. Um, he's six foot two, 290 pounds, a bit undersized. And what you're going to think is, or what you're going to say is, hey, man, I know somebody else that went to pit. I know somebody else that's an undersized three tech. Yes, and that guy's name is Aaron Donald. Okay, him and Aaron Donald actually work out together. And there's some features, there's some traits that kind of, Look very similar to Aaron Donald. I'm not calling him Aaron, him Aaron Donald by any means. I don't think he is as explosive as Aaron Donald is. He's not as fast as Aaron Donald is. So there's some things uh, that that we need to work on. But as I've, I've you know done you know some Pitt videos, and I told you guys Pitt has some talent. Um, when I did Paris Ford's uh, um, video, 97 kept popping out. I, I watched him play and destroy Florida State. I'm like, who is this kid? Uh, he just opted out, uh, trying to prepare for the draft. So listen, I, I'm excited. I, I've seen him a couple times, but I haven't really like sat down and watched just for him. So this time, I'm gonna take a look at him and see what we have in a uh, in a uh, Jalen Twyman. Man, listen, I'm I'm look. Pitt Pitt has some talent, bro. Pitt has some talent. This dude had 11 sacks last year, uh, four quarterback hits, uh, 34. Uh, excuse me, 21 hurries. So a total of 36 pressures. Um, again, 36 pressures on 440 some odd snaps. You like to get, you like to see him pressure the quarterback a little bit more consistently there. Uh, but listen, uh, he, he's still, you know, developing. He's uh, underside, and listen, he's he's got time. He's got time. I don't think he's going to be like a second, third round pick. I think somebody's going to get a steal late. Uh, but we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Let's jump into this film though, uh, and uh, get it cracking. Um, Ish, uh, I keep wanting to say Ishmael Hyman. That's who we have, one of our wide receivers. Jalen Twyman. Uh, let's get it. Let's take a look at uh, UCF. UCF, why not? UCF. Number 97 for those that are keeping track. 97. Ooh, chop blocks there. Or cut blocks, excuse me. Mm, geez. Geez. That was 91, not 97, so don't get confused. So yeah, again, six foot two, two hundred and ninety, uh, ninety pounds. If you compare him to Aaron Donald, I think Aaron Donald is six one, two eighty four, but he's extremely powerful and uh, extremely, extremely quick. So um, again, when you're on, oh, nice tackle. Uh, when you're on that that defensive line, you can't get moved around. And uh, oh, nice pick. You don't want to get moved around. So you gotta you gotta be quick and explosive, uh, being that undersized. And that's exactly what Aaron Donald man, because cut blocks are crazy. All those cut blocks. Not really seeing much here so far. Not really seeing much. A lot of hand fighting, just a lot of getting caught up, a lot of getting pushed around right there. Nothing, nothing so far is uh jumping out to me. Double team right there, playing patty cake. Have, bake me a cake as fast as you can. You ain't doing nothing. Come on now. It's cut blocks, man. Those cut blocks are design, designed to get the uh, the pass rusher's hands down, okay? When, when you get cut block, you, you, you have a tendency to uh, drop your hands. Nice. That was a nice play right there. Nice run stop. Again, just because you're small does not mean you can't play defensive tackle. Again, Eric Donald is defying all those odds. You got to be quick. Nice. Yeah. Somebody shot the gap but couldn't get there. Another name you want to think about when you think about three techs and uh, a pass rush in three techs, that's, that's essentially what um, – what he is, that's what Twyman is. He's a pass rushing uh, three tech. And so when you think about that, think about uh, F.A. Obata for us. F.A. Obata comes in and sometimes he plays, uh, sometimes he plays in inside on third downs. And that's what, that's essentially what he is. And F.A. Obata is not a 300 pound cat. He's under undersized three tech. Sometimes he plays that, that role. Yeah, I'm not really seeing much from this kid so far. We're in the third quarter. I ain't seen really no impact plays so far. 
Nice hit. Nice swim move. He got a nice swim move. Nice throw. Really good throw. Cut blocks. Yeah, if I don't see, I don't really don't see no plays here, man. Somebody really wasted their time cutting this film up. Cause I ain't seeing Jack. Man, they let them come back. What a catch. It's Paris four right there. Nice. Mm, there we go. That was a 97, but nice play. Oh, oh man. Nice. There we go. There's a sack. I was about to say that's a good good pursuit right there. Relentless. Uh and that pretty much ended the game. Um but yeah, nothing nothing really um you know, groundbreaking or got to have them. But we'll take a look at uh the Syracuse film. It's, it's a short one. It's a short one right here. Syracuse Mm, drop that thing. Forgot something. Getting double teamed up front. Yeah, I like to see him beat that one on one. Uh, again, playing Patty Kate. Uh, he's getting moved right there. He got moved off the line. So. Yeah, I mean, this is one on one pretty much. Sack for 28 and 91. Here we go. Nice swim move. He's got a, that, that swim move. He might be overusing that thing. I see him swimming a lot. Got to get in the pool. I'm sorry, I'm going to call him Michael Phelps. He used that swim move a lot. A lot of patty cake right there. A lot of patty cake. Mm, right up the gut. Right up the gut. I don't know how that many dudes got to the to the quarterback, but there was a lot of dudes running at the quarterback just a second ago. Nice, nice run stop. I'm not really seeing Twyman do anything. Maybe I picked the wrong film. Nice. There we go. Got him one right there after everybody else ran past him. <laughs> Two other dudes ran past him where he stepped up. And I uh, got him. Nice, nice play. Swim move again. Michael Phelps. Jalen Phelps is what another sack. It's good, relentless play. I, I caught out more of a coverage. Uh, quarterback had to scram. Ooh, Paris, you had to do your boy like that. Mm, he's out. He's out. He's out. Damn. Gave him a big play. Nice. Nice. Ah. That's all kind of PI, bro. Yeah. Tom had a couple sacks in this game. A little bit better. A little bit, ooh, Paris, you dropped that one. Paris is balling in this game. Not to turn this into a Paris 4 film, but he's doing it himself. Nice tackle, number three. Ah. Ah, I missed him. You know where for him to go. Swim move again. Oh, he's killing that swim move, bro. Jalen Phillips is what I'm going to call him. Nice tackle. Nice. It's a good run stop. 
double team. He got held a lot. He got held. Oh, he kind of gave up on that play right there. Never want to see you guys give up. Dang, I do, a lot of dudes ended up on the ground so quick. All right, so that's going to be um, that's going to be uh, Jalen Twyman. Um, yeah, we don't need to look at another one. Uh, but yeah, man, for him, man, I don't know, man. Like, I don't know. He's he's going to be undersized, so I'm I'm sure he's going to fall. He's got to be in the right position, the right scenario to succeed. Uh, I see him as a situational third down uh, pass rushing back or, or pass rushing lineman. Um, although we didn't see it much there, uh, I, I'm not seeing that. I'm not definitely not seeing the Aaron Donald comparisons. I might get it because of their size, but I'm, I'm not seeing that. I'm not seeing him do it consistently enough. Most of his sacks came, I would call those cover sacks. Like he didn't just dominate his dude and, uh, pause and just, you know, kind of, you know, beat, beat his man and then go to the, get to the quarterback. Those are more, you know, the quarterback held on the ball too long. He scrambled and then he gets them. So, I don't know. I'm 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 kind of I'm I'm on the fence. I definitely late round. I'm not. I don't think see anything past the fourth round for me personally. Uh, but if you have, if you had the system where you could, you know, get them in there on a, on a rotational basis, um, on you know on, on a you know pass rushing downs things like that because he's gonna get bullied. Uh, I saw him get pushed around a lot even in college. Those college linemen, those college linemen are put, pushing you around. Just imagine what uh, the NFL linemen are gonna do to you. So. Uh, he's got a little work to do, got a little work to do, but he's, he can be somebody's project. Uh, and hopefully he can, he can develop into some, uh, some, uh, a little bit, maybe a, a bit, maybe about a quarter or half of what Aaron Donald could do. If you can get to that, then I would, I would say you're have you're going to have a pretty solid career in the NFL. Uh, but I, I'm not seeing it personally and maybe I missed something. Uh, if, if I missed something, man, make sure y'all, uh, hit me in the comments saying, nah, you, you way off or you spot on. Let me know what you think. Uh, that being said, that's going to be uh, Jalen Twyman uh, from Pitt, uh, and I'll holler at y'all next one. All right, peace.